video and as you guys can hear by the title I'm gonna be doing basically like a let's talk about hygiene video because hygiene is very important in a day's life especially as a female before we get started this video make sure you give it a big thumbs up subscribe down below and also comment so you can see more videos of me and turn on your post notification bell so you can notify every single time I post another video so let's get started with the video all right so the first thing we're going to talk about is the soap that you use so the first soap that I use and I, I've been using for literally forever is Dove, which is the sensitive skin soap, the bar soap. So I use that soap on my face and I also use it down there as well because it's sensitive skin and has no scent. And you want to make sure that you use a non-scented soap when you're washing down there because you don't want to throw off your pH balance when you're using like scented stuff. Wait to use your scented soaps like on your body like around your body and stuff so you can smell good so for my other body i like to use scented soaps the scented soap that i use is the dough pampering shea butter and vanilla soap i've been using this soap for like probably about like a month and i just love vanilla scents and so i just love this soap so much it smells literally so good I love any like Dove soaps and it just smells so good. And for like body washes, for my vanilla scent, I like to use the Coffee Bean Oat Milk Latte by Beloved. I literally picked this up today at Target and it smells so good. They have a vanilla one, but I really like, I didn't like the vanilla one because it smells like, like too much chocolatey and so this one smells like vanilla even though it's like coffee bean and latte like it literally smells so good so this is shower gel and bath gel and it's vegan so yeah it's so good and if you're not like a vanilla scent girl like if you don't like the smell of vanilla stuff i also use moroccan um foam and shower gel as well by tree hut i use this like when i'm using like my rose scent because I don't like mixing scents and stuff. So I use that for when I'm using like rose scents and all that stuff. And that smells good as well. All right, so for the next thing, we're going to talk about like shave products. So for the rose girls that like to have like rose scents and like floral scents, I like to use the EOS Pomegranate Raspberry Shave Cream. Like it smells so good, especially when using like rose floral soaps and stuff, scented stuff. And it's by EOS. And I like to use this only for the upper body though, like I said, because you don't want to use scented stuff down there. Um, if you're shaving down there, I like to use like a non-scented soap. And if you're like a vanilla girl, I like to use the Vanilla Bliss, also by EOS, the shave cream. And this one smells so good as well. For my razors, the razors I like to use are the Target razors. This is a file blade razor. This razor is so good. Like me, my mom, my sister, we use this razor all the time. Love these razors. It comes with five of them and it has a five blades as well. Cause you want to use like razors that have like three and up blades because like one blade or two blade, it's not gonna like get everything. Or you can use like a man razor, all this type of stuff. But like a two blade or a one blade, mm -mm. get you one of these. Yeah. <laughs> and so for my scrubs, I don't have them right now because I use all my scrubs. But the one that I do use is either like a tree hut scrub to match with the floral scents, or I just recently used this Walmart brand one. It smells really good for vanilla scents as well. I'm gonna put a picture of both of the scrubs here so you can see which ones I'm talking about. And I like to use those before I shave because you don't wanna have any razor bumps after you shave. So I like to use those scrubs. And if you're shaving down there, 
make sure you use like either like a non-scented soap or just like a non-scented scrub before shaving and stuff because you don't want to have any red bumps down there as well all right so for the next topic we're going to talk about lotions and like oils and all types of stuff back again with the vanilla scent since i love vanilla i like to use the eos vanilla cashmere lotion or i normally would have like um what is that brand called nivea Nivi, nivea something like that but it's just this one or that one smells really good. I like to use this one. And then I like to use my Handy Dandy Body Oil Gel. Because this combo eats every time. This right here smells so good together, y'all. Y'all got to try it, like, for real. This and this. Mm. But this is just, like, a body oil. But make sure you don't put this on your clothes because... Mm -hmm. and this is also good after shaving as well like this lotion like it softens like since it's EOS it's really good because like it makes you feel smooth like for some reason it makes you feel smooth and then especially with this since it's oil it makes you feel smooth as well so I think y'all should try this first and put y'all on if you're like a rose girl I like to use I'm gonna get a raspberry lotion as well by EOS. Or I like to use my Moroccan Rose Body Butter by Tree Hut. I like, or I like to mix these in for real, for real. But they both smell good to me. Like if you like floral girl and you like floral scents. So use these two, you gonna smell good too. This is like a lotion for down there or if you have sensitive skin you can't like use like scented lotions and stuff like that like all that stuff like that like my mom and my sister they both have excellent so they can't like really use scented lotions like that or they're gonna break out so if you got that then i like to use the sensitive skin relief by vaseline and i like to use this for down there and also like all of my body i'm like not feeling like the scented like lotion for real for real and this is really good we've been using this for like i don't know how long um this is really good as well so all right so now for my little favorite favorite part and like i have so many of these i just love them so much like for real so it is perfume i'm gonna start with like vanilla scented perfumes first if that makes sense because i don't know I just like these vanilla scents perfumes. The first one I like to use is the white by Kenneth Cole for her. I like to use the perfume. It literally like smells so good. I don't know what it is, but it smells so good. It's not really like vanilla scented, but it smells good. If that makes sense. Or I like to use warm vanilla sugar by Bath and Body Works. This smells so good as well. Y'all see. I barely got nothing in it because I use this so much. Like it smells so good. Then I have this Walmart brand Body Ecology. It's cozy fireside s'mores. This here, like it smells. It smells like s'mores. Like it just smells like. Like, let me read y'all this description right here. It says. Return to the warm memory of a fireside s'more with an aroma of marshmallow, sandalwood, and a hint of milk chocolate. It smells like, it just smells like, I don't know, it just smells so good. Like, I just can't explain it. But it's like limited edition though. And it smells good, trust me. So the next one I have is like this Target brand. I don't know, it's Finery something. I don't even know like what scent this is, but it's like in a brown brown bottle. This also smells good as well. I just got this like a couple weeks ago. I haven't used it a lot, but it smells super good as well. This is my mom's perfume, but I like this. I like this a lot. It's the Barberry Goddess and like it literally I don't know like 
y'all probably not gonna believe me when i say this stuff smells good it just smells so good like literally like it smells like i don't know how to explain it it just smells good like it just smells good <laughs> y'all gotta smell for yourself i don't know how much this is but i know like most of these are like under ten dollars for a room but this right here get you these spurs okay my last thing is like a body oil i got this from beauty plus though it's smell like chloe um it's from the have a scent collection it's like five dollars and like i don't know do they have a chloe perfume i think i think they do i looked it up but it's like a body roll-on oil this smells good as well like i literally use this every single day since i bought it i bought it like a week ago and this is where i'm at in it like i still haven't like even touched down here like it smells good i just roll this on boom pop this on my neck boom it smells good for real <laughs> and so for the days when like i want to wear like floral scents to match like with all my floral scented stuff i like to use the victoria's secret velvet petals this is like a small bottle but this smells good too don't get me wrong this smells good like it's like let me read the description for y'all it's lush blooms almond glaze made you blush like it's so cute and then i got the matching shimmer thing so you can put it on your body so you can look good and also smell good for real this look like it's like iridescent glitter inside of it this smells good too like this here eat the girls up for real like all right so the next thing we'll talk about is like just something random so i make sure that i drink like a bottle of water every day or like a cup of water every single day or two cups of water every single day because it just helps you on the inside and also makes your skin clear recently i haven't been drinking water that much because i don't know if y'all can see that right there my face been breaking out like bad now i'm gonna try to drink at least like two cups of water or a bottle of water every single day so it can help my face and also help like my body and my digestive system and all that type of stuff we're gonna talk about periods and pads and all types of stuff for your period you want to make sure that you change so your pad or your tampon or like a menstrual cup if y'all use those or whatever you want to make sure you change like once every two to three hours especially when you have a pad on or like a tampon because you don't want nobody smelling nothing nobody's saying that you stank or none of that stuff so you want to make sure you smell fresh these are the pads that i like to use and it's the always ultra thin pads and i get the number two the long super ones but you can use like these are the ones that i like to use i've been using these for like ever since i got my period so these these are good right here and this one also has wings as well but yeah i like to use this because it's just i don't use tampons so like pads it's your go-to for real i don't trust tampons i don't use tampons mm. i'm a pad girly i don't know about y'all but i'm a pad girly for real all right so now we're gonna get into the face product so what i like to wash my face with I use a Dove Sense to the Skin bar as well. Dove unscented stuff helps literally a lot with like your skin and all that stuff. It makes your skin 100% clear. And yeah. I also like to use the Neutrogena Hydro Boost. I've been using this for like two months probably. I don't know. But this stuff right here, just get the job done for real. Like it makes your face like it like brightens your face for some reason it says gently cleanses and effectively removes dirt oil and makeup while increasing skin's hydration and for a face mask i like to use the freeman polishing black charcoal scrub it's like a face mask and a scrub but it's like charcoal black like that oh oops <laughs> i saw this on my brother cabinet one day and I used it once. I bought this ever since, y'all. It literally, it feels good and it works good for some reason. 
this is for all skin types and i use this for like i don't know i just use it whenever and i i let this sit for like five to seven minutes on my face i like take a shower in it and like yeah it just it smells good to me and it like works so y'all just try that <laughs> All right, so now we're gonna talk about the moisturizers and like things I put on my face. So this is the first thing I put on my face. So this is the, like I said, the sensitive skin relief Vaseline thing. I use on my face. It don't even matter like if I'm putting none of the other products back on my face. I put this on my face first. Like this is the base thing that I use on my face every single time in the morning, at night, whenever. Like my face feeling dry, I put this on my face like this stuff. It actually works like it helps smooth the dry skin because I have like very dry skin and all types of stuff so put this on your face boom so the next thing I use is the La Roche Posay I don't know how to say this stuff this is like a French or some type of brand and this is a triple repair moisturizing cream this stuff works so good y'all I don't know like it helps with dry skin as well this it can also be like a lotion or something like that if you have sensitive skin. And I like using this. Like I saw this in my own room one day and we kind of took it from her. So I have a mini one as well, but this is hers. So I use this one. This is hers. So this right here, it works so good. The next thing I put on my face is either Aquaphor or Vaseline, which I probably put both. So Aquaphor is basically like Vaseline. I just started using Aquaphor like, probably like a couple months ago. And I actually like this, but it like kind of dries out your skin for real, for real. So I like to use my Vaseline a lot. And this is the vitamin E one. So this is like, I don't know. I don't know if there are different ones or not. I know it's like a cocoa butter one, but this is the vitamin E one. I like to use this a lot, like on my lips, especially like when it's cold outside, I like to use this all the time. But I keep this, or I keep both of these in my purse forever, so I like to use these. So for the last thing I put on my face, this is new, this is my mom's. Don't tell her I got it. <laughs> but this is the Summer Fridays All-in-One Face Oil. And this stuff works really good. As y'all see my face, it's like glowing because I put this on my face before this video. And it works good. It's like a hydrator and a conditioner like for your face. The usage says, gently smooth skin is the final step in your skincare routine. So I normally add like one to two droplets of this for like morning and night. And so it works really, really good. Like, it just makes your face, like, bright. Like, I don't know. <laughs> so, for my lips, as y'all see, to keep them cute and fresh and hydrated, I like to use the Lange something lip stick and mask. I like to use this in the morning and at night. This came in, like, a little set. So, like, it has this one. This is berry fruit ridges or something like that. And this is chocolate so this one came like a little set i use this every single time it literally works magic like, i love it so much all right so for deodorant i like to use the secret ph balance powder fresh invisible hold this deodorant like it will literally it just smells so good and then another deodorant for like the summertime i like to use Dove spray on deodorant. I put a picture of what I like to use, but these two deodorants like top tier for reference. <laughs> All right, so now for my teeth, as y'all see, I got braces, so it takes a lot to keep your teeth clean, especially when you have braces. So you want to make sure that you brush your teeth like literally every single day, probably like twice a day. I brush my teeth twice a day morning and night and probably even after you eat food make sure you floss and all types of stuff because you don't want nothing in your teeth you want to make sure that your teeth are looking cute at all times so for my teeth i like to use the colgate max fresh charcoal mint 
I like to use the toothpaste. I've been using this toothpaste for like a week. Or I like to use the Arm & Hammer toothpaste that has baking soda in it. I'm going to put a picture of what that looks like as well. I like to use both of them. Alright, so for showers, I like to shower like once a day. Maybe even twice a day, but once a day. Because you want to make sure that your body is fresh and all types of stuff. So shower once a day because you don't want nobody saying you stink. You don't want nobody saying you musty or none of that stuff. So make sure you take a shower at least once a day. For shaving, I like to shave every two weeks. Like, especially in the summertime, I like to shave like probably like once a week. So make sure you shower once a day. Shave probably like every two to three weeks if your hair doesn't grow back fast. Probably like once a week if your hair does grow back fast. And like for face, I like to shave my face as well. I like to use a face razor to get my little mustache right here and then my like, what's this? This little thing right here. <laughs> and then I put on like a Vaseline or like an oil on my face so I won't get any type of bumps on my face after I shave. Alright you guys, so that's it for my video. It was like a quick little short video this time. And if you enjoyed the video, like I said, make sure you give it a big thumbs up, subscribe down below, and also comment so you can see more videos of me. And make sure you turn on your post notification bell so you can be notified every single time I post another video. And make sure you follow me on all of my socials so you can stay connected with me at all times. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see y'all in my next one. Bye, guys. Thank you.